Hello water signs, welcome back to my channel, Presence of a Goddess. Thank you guys for joining me today. Today is just gonna be a under seven minute Saturday for my water signs. So if it resonates, awesome. I appreciate you subscribe, like, and share those who you think it'll resonate too. And if you want to book a personal reading with me, the information is down below. And if you want to donate to the channel, it's highly appreciated. All right, I'm gonna try to keep this under seven minutes, y'all. That's the challenge here. Okay, so what I've been meditating for my Cancer Scorpios and Pisces is something about superhero, okay? Superheroes don't have capes or something like that. I'm also being like, maybe you're helping someone and they see you as a hero or as an angel, or this could be your child looking up to you and they see you as like, this could even be someone in a relationship that like they see you as this hero, this angel, you saved them. I also feel like you saved somebody from suicide. Maybe somebody wanted to kill themselves, but when they saw you or you said something, you, you actually saved them. You could be like a speaker, a motivational speaker, or you just have a like good energy everywhere you go. Okay, I'm also getting a bull. Somebody could have Taurus placements here or Aries placements, but I'm also getting like um, somebody could have surgery because I'm seeing somebody under a light something about surgery or you're about to get good news about your test results at, at, in a doctor's office or something like that so congratulations i see miracles happening for you okay what we have are my cancer scorpios and pisces yeah that's the truth the ace of swords here okay you're about to get some clear communication direct communication something is being like given directly to you cutting out the middleman all right it's like no third parties it's just going to get straight to you okay because something could have been blocked because somebody was trying to fight so hard to block something from you, but now it's coming straight to you. Also, like somebody told something to someone to relate to you and they never gave you the message. All right, so you're about to get the message you were meant to receive here. Yeah, that's the truth, the Six of Cups. It could be dealing something with, child, with a child or your childhood or your inner child here, okay? Something's gonna be fulfilling for you, okay? Something about a secret is gonna come out from your childhood as well. All right, like somebody, hey, hidden motives or they secretly told somebody something and maybe they never told you and now they're going to tell you all right what else do we have for water signs thank you spirit yeah yeah something about something keeping you stuck but now you're in your power and i don't want to see it somebody definitely wanted to keep you stuck in a situation so they never relate this message to you okay i'm getting heavy on the communication here somebody wanted to start something with you or they were instigating or something okay yeah somebody wanted to make something hard this has something to do with love i feel like somebody wanted to keep you from being happy with someone so they did not tell something that was meant to be told to you so this would could have like stopped you from this union with someone or someone is purposely trying to miscommunicate something instigate something so that you don't be happy in this new relationship well i always get that from my water signs okay this could be family who is hating on you here there's a family secret that's about to be revealed here all right yeah something about car gas something being fueled or fuel to the fire somebody wanted to add fuel to the fire but something is over all right this could be like after somebody died you want to uh, get the truth here yeah two of cups here this is also a transformation of a, in a relationship here some about a contract here as well maybe you want to get direct information about a contract here or to sign something somebody did not want you to sign something or something was voided and now it's not being voided it's about to be reinstated a car could be getting reinstated or a home i also feel like something is being returned to you okay something about property something that is divinely yours is being given back to you because somebody wanted to take something from you this could be forging here this could be family who did this but i'm also getting like someone wanted to like annul you from a marriage or they didn't want you to get into a marriage here but you are about to get into a union with someone but someone did not want you want this to happen this could be like maybe you just was your baby father for some guys or baby mother this could also be like um somebody you could have gotten divorced from like somebody don't want you to be in love here yeah so somebody's trying to pin something on you or they're trying to say oh yeah, it's like family hating on you. They don't want to see you happy. They don't want to see you happy because maybe they were relying on you. And now now you're happy. They might. Yeah, okay. Watch out for that. Yeah, the temperance, Sagittarius energy, Scorpio energy, Capricorn energy, Taurus energy. Something about a possession here. Okay, something you work hard on. They want what you, what you work hard for. They feel entitled to your energy, entitled to your possessions, entitled to your love life. Like, they don't want you to have a love life. They want you to be busy for them. They want you to do things for them. All right? Like, this is crazy to me. I'm also getting like, they were the reason why you could not be happy. Okay? But I feel like you make everyone happy, even if they don't tell you this here. 
but you're about to get into a union with someone it's about to transform into some true love here okay strong connection with someone period okay you're an angel yeah five of wands someone wants to make something hard for you and they're also trying to get you to like choose them like choose us or choose you you're gonna choose your child or you're gonna choose a new woman or a new man or something like that. I, what? Okay, I don't know. Like they don't they don't want you to get into this union. See, this is a union you're destined to be in, but somebody really trying to like <laughs> they want you to separate. They don't want y'all to be together. I'm hearing that song by Akon. They don't wanna see us together, no, but I got you. So maybe you wanna come to realize that somebody was definitely trying to keep you buying to them by half ass telling the truth. Somebody was lying. Maybe they said you said something trying to make you mad and trying to say, oh, so-and-so said this and they really didn't or so-and-so is this and they really not. So it's like, don't believe what other people say. See it for yourself when it comes to this lover. Okay, and don't listen to that negative talk here. Yeah, hitting the gym, it could be an Aries trying to bully you. Uh, the color blue could be significant, but this is heavy on communication. Throat chakra, Gemini, Wednesday, okay? Twin flame, this is twin flame here. But somebody does not want you to be in that. They want to make your make it seem like you are not meant for this or they are not meant for you. But it's something for you to see for yourself. You know what I'm saying? Because like somebody, their intentions are not good. Yeah, okay, feelings are mutual. Because this person, this twin flame, this soulmate does have the same feelings for you. But someone does not want you to know that here. This could even be a karmic person trying to come back in your life and try to portray like they're the ones for you. Or, some, or something like that. Yeah, because you and your grown man, your grown woman. And somebody don't like that. They don't like that you're making decisions by yourself now. They want you to believe everything they said, but you're looking at them like, I don't believe you. Because, yeah, so somebody's mad that you don't believe them anymore. Baby daddy, okay? Thank you, next. Okay, this could be somebody's baby father here. I, I'm going over seven minutes, but whatever. I tried, y'all. Yeah, I have breakup and rat. Yeah, somebody's an informant. Somebody going to tell on themselves. Or you, they want y'all to break up. So they're going to rat and say something. Or this is a lie to me. Yeah, prayers, power struggle. That's true. I told you somebody's trying to bully you into you're with me. You, you can't be with them. So this could even be an ex that's doing this. They feel entitled to your energy. Or this is a family situation. Like, no, you don't have to be in love or something. Like, they don't want you to be in love. Like, what? Because <sighs> you have the money. Maybe you have financial stability, okay? And maybe that's going to mess up their situation with you. Or if they're using you. If it's not finances, they're using you for your energy, your time. Like, they feel entitled to you. Yeah, failure. Forgiveness. The plan has failed. The plan is failing. And now they want to want forgiveness. Surrenders. You need to surrender and be grateful for this person that's coming in your life because they are your twin flame. Somebody just want to want you to be lonely because they cannot accept the fact that you're in love. Yeah, because somebody's envious. I told you. That's why. I can't make this stuff up. I don't lie. Yeah, inner knowing. You know this deep down inside. Somebody's hating on a relationship here. Yeah, new opportunities and spiritual gifts. You deserve this love. I told you. That's period. Don't listen to nobody but what you know, what you said, what you feel. Okay? Love you guys.